life just never goes as planned. Totally rigging the line. <laughs> just beautiful. Look at this. Get him. Taylor, seriously. Once his scale's red, I walked literally right past this snake. Life just never goes as planned. It's never simple. No. So we've been talking about that a lot, how life is just always throwing you curveballs. You can't do anything without everything just going to absolute shit. Um, it's been one of those days, one of those weeks. We're sitting here at the red light getting ready to go to the river to that we're going to go explore canoeing. and go canoeing. And so we just rear-ended our canoe after we've been parked here at a red light waiting. And the guy does not seem to care. So it looks like the canoe is sitting on his hood. And the guy doesn't care, and we don't care, because, it, I don't know. Did we care? It didn't hit us out. that hard. I told you to get out. Taylor told me to get out. We're just gonna hope it's Look at his safe. car, look at his car. I'm gonna about his car. So we planned this canoeing trip. We already got rear-ended. And now it's raining. It's supposed to be nice and sunny all day. But it's not. I'm gonna totally breaking our fishing pole. No, no, he's rigging the line. Oh, so he's, he's totally rigging the line. He might have actually just taken everything off. <laughs> we made it. Stormy. Look at that water move. So much for hitting the water. Yeah, no. I forgive you, Rhett. It's my fault. It looks like our river exploration is going to be put off for another day. And we're just going to have to go out and herp tonight and see if we can find anything after this big storm comes through. And another day without foe. Because you won't let me get I'm so foe. sick of hearing about foe. I just want foe. I'm just asking you to go to my ears. I don't know, we can use this. What lure should we throw? Hey, Tobe, how about this one? Or this one? This one's been torn up by so many snakes. Yeah, get that, uh, get that fishing lure ready for me. Don't whistling ducks, Tobe. Hear that storm, Tobe? Can I see that? Can I see it? No. Look at all the lightning. It's not safe out here. Can I see the fishing lure? Have it, please. How about this hand? This hand? Maybe? You're so nice. Thank you. Okay, so here. I'm just looking at it. Okay, you can look at it again. He's so bad. Ooh. Ooh. Look at fast with it. Tom. <laughs> what? what? Why can't you fish? Why can't I fish? I don't know, Toby. Why can't I fish? There's no handle. Let's go look for it, Toby. <laughs> Summer rolls, Toby. We're stuck with a salad. A salad! How dare he? Oh, okay, now you want it. Okay. He doesn't like it. He wants the... <laughs> he wants the marshmallows. Despite um, Toby always eating snacks on the camera, he has a very healthy diet. We just let them have snacks every, usually weekly. Everyone gets one cheat day a week. Including Toby. Look at this. This is what happened to our canoe day, Florida in the summer. Don't move here. I just learned that Taylor doesn't like red olives. But more importantly, I just learned that there's such a thing as red olives. <laughs> You're so dumb. Look at them, they're not red, they're brown. Are they actually red? Brown. So I'm like super colorblind, and uh, I I'm often, and, and then I learn uh, colors of things that I didn't know, and I had no idea olives could be red. I just, what about red olives? Anyhow, learned something new today. We're trapped in the car, man. I was looking forward to hitting the water, swimming in the deep water with the gators. Cub bite.
Yeah, clean that. Look at that. Earwax for dessert, baby. Ow. Ooh, yeah. Ow. I, got, I got that good earwax. Where, where'd he go? <laughs> what is he doing? Oh, B. I feel like we're in Jumanji. <laughs> we're living freaking Jumanji. So the lightning and the rain uh, let up just for a few minutes before sunset. We came all the way out here, so we just had to get out in the water for a few minutes and see what we can see. The water's moving really fast, and it's just beautiful out here. Look at this. Toby, quit enticing the alligators. You look like a delicious little snack. Toby. Red torch that butt. Ooh, daddy. Hmm. Oh, you're still on this paddle thing? He's always such help cleaning, paddling. That's not how you paddle. Where's your life vest, Tope? Did you grab the life vest for us? He's been paddling for like 10 minutes straight. The cicadas are almost deafening. Look how gorgeous this is. So we got a big old uh, lightning storm moving in on us from behind. And look, we got a big old storm coming in from the front. So we're gonna change places and go uh, do some herping. Wish us luck. You're gonna need some luck. We this need is... it. <laughs> yeah. That's an annul. Stopped at a canal on the way home to look for some stuff. Uh, it's pretty good for lizards and uh, occasionally some decent snakes show up here. So. We'll see what we can scrounge up. Toby, do you see it? Ooh, it looks dragonfly. A nice sparkly one by Fruity. Fruity. Oh, wait. No, it's a stick. He's right back on the road. Oh my gosh. He's moving. Get him. No. Taylor, seriously. Dude, I'm done with him. Wait, 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 wait. How does he blend in so well? Right here, I'll turn on my headlamp and I'll tell him what just happened. All right, guys, that was crazy hectic. I walked right past this green water snake and said, hey, Tay, green water, and kept walking. She goes, hey, rat. That's red, and I was like, what? Because I'm so <laughs> colorblind, I didn't even know it was red. And this is a snake that I've been wanting to find a really long time. This is an erythristic, a red-phased, green water snake. He's not green at all. It's because he's got a, a genetic mutation going on that turns his scales red. I walked literally right past this snake, and he shot into the grass, and you can see we literally had to hunt up this whole area, and I finally found him. And this is like a snake I've really, really wanted to see. I've seen probably thousands and thousands of green water snakes and this is the first red one that i've noticed i probably we were talking He's about probably it. walked <laughs> by so many red ones like mm -hmm, whatever just another green one yeah i thought they'd stand out more than this but i took some really cool flash photos that made his color just pop and i'm going to show you guys those he's so sweet is he a stump tail he is stump tailed. Oh I wonder if his bright coloration made some other color seeing animal. See? Oh no, he blends in. He does. More he for me than really... greens do. Oh, it's his musk that smells like. Oh. <laughs> and Good. You wouldn't think that a red snake would camouflage, but the second this dude hit the grass, he was gone. He's and awesome. this is so cool. A red phased green water snake. Wow, are you getting eaten by bugs? Yeah, they're me? Really oh my horrible. God. That's awesome.
Can I get video of it in the tree still or did it move? Yeah. Oh, good spot. Toby was Great spot. at it. Oh, Toby. Toby, you try and eat it? Is that why he's running around? Yeah. I didn't see it at first. Good spot. To nice Toby little. Toby man. It's a nice little, what used to be considered Everglades rat snake. It's eyes orangish. It's going to be a beautiful Everglades rat snake someday. All right, we're gonna get him down and show you guys. You bitey little guy, come here. Oh. You bite? No. Look at that, even a diffused pattern here. You wanna hold him? Uh, you be nicer, Toad. I'm gonna kill your light. You'll be nice to baby snakies. Yeah, you give baby mm. snakies kisses. Slow night, but an awesome night, so. Every night with you guys is awesome. All right, guys, it has been a hectic day. We started out with our rear ending of our poor canoe. Uh, we got shut out by storms, but we still ended up catching some really cool animals. That red water snake was a first for me. Uh, first time I've ever seen an erythristic uh, green you water snake. You still see it, Brett. You still think it's green. <laughs> no, I could tell. I, I took some really cool flash photos. I'll show you guys. It really made that red pop to where I could even see it. It was super cool, and that's a snake I've wanted to find for a long time and then also we got that cute little Everglades rat snake so uh, don't forget to like subscribe and we'll see you next time thanks for joining <laughs>